What's up guys, welcome back. We're going to be solving another question in today's video from second chapter of Merriam textbook question 48 and we have a gate that is held in the position shown by cable AB. We know the tension in the cable is 6.75 kilonewtons and we need to determine the moment of tension applying at point A about the pivot point of the gate at point O. Um, so as covered in the previous videos, the force that we have in here is this tension and this would be the line of action in here. So basically we can go with uh, any point in here as our position vector, but since if we try to dissolve the force and the tension in the cable in this direction, so this will be our, if we call our x and y in this direction, uh, we can find the x and y component of t if we call this angle here maybe theta. So we'll have this one t sine of theta and the other one will be t cosine of theta. And going with the 2D shortcut that we have for the moment is pretty easy to find the moment about point O uh, where we call counterclockwise positive. So first of all we need to figure out that theta which is basically this angle 2. And the way we're going to find theta is that, so obviously we need this side over this side if we want to go with the tangent of theta. We have to figure out that part. So we know this whole distance from here to here is 7. So if we subtract that by this side of this right triangle, which we know this angle is 60 degrees. So we know in this right triangle, this will be 6 sine of 60 degrees and the other base here would be 6 cosine of 60 degrees and we have this little distance here which is 0.4 meter from the question so basically if you want to find the this side here we have 7 minus this one which is 6 sine of 60 degrees minus that little distance 0.4 over and what we have in here for data we need to figure out this distance as i mentioned which is this part which was 66 cosine of 60 degrees plus what we have from here to here which is 2 so basically our tangent of theta would be if we calculate the numerator we get 1.4 and we have 3 plus 2 in the denominator or 5 and from here we can find theta tangent inverse of 1.4 over 5 which will be 15.6 degrees and now we're good to go to find the moment now that we have the angle theta so uh, if we get back in here we will see that we have the moment of the t sine of theta which will be a clockwise moment so negative t sine of theta will be 15.6 and the distance for that that one would be basically 2 and from the question we also know that t is 6.75 so there is no unknown left here plus uh, we have the moment of t cosine of theta and since it's a counterclockwise so it will be positive t cosine of 15.6 degrees times this time we will have the distance from uh, point O to B. So I'm talking about this distance, which is basically 7 minus 0.4. And that would be pretty much everything. And as I mentioned, our T is 6.75 kilonewton. So if we calculate this, the moment will be 39.9 kilonewton meter which would be the final answer for this question um so yeah that would be all for this one please let me know if you have any questions uh don't forget to subscribe to the channel like and comment it's going to help me to reach out to more students and you guys take care i'll see you in the next video have a good one